Hi there, welcome back to Goal Niza channel, the unsung hero, the lung of Argentina national or Lionel Messi's henchman. These are the nicknames that football fans give Rodrigo Di Paul after a wonderful World Cup in Qatar. So for those who don't know much about this man, let's watch this video to find out. Rodrigo Di Paul is from a city known for its leather industry and tanning process. His hometown was impacted by pollution caused by their industrial activities. He was born to Roberto Di Paul and Monica Ferrarotti, who divorced when Di Paul was a child. Three siblings moved in with their mother after their parents parted away. Miss Monica is a strong woman who previously worked as a manager in a local leather shoe company, so she could provide for her children's needs. Rodrigo Di Paul has two brothers, Damien and Guido. In 2016, Di Paul started dating the Argentine model Camilla Hans, who is very famous on the internet, with nearly 900k followers on Instagram. The couple share two kids with each other, a daughter Francesca born in 2019 and a son Batista born in 2021. However, after five years together, the couple separated in 2021 and the kids are living with their mother. The footballer is dating Martina Stosel, better known by her stage name Tini. She is a singer, songwriter, actress, dancer, and model from Argentina. Tini rose to prominence as the lead in the Disney original series Vio Letter. She is fluent in Spanish, English, and Italian. She has over 330 Kelvin Instagram followers and a large fan base on other social media platforms. In 2017, she was named Honorary Ambassador of World Peace. In the middle of the year 2021, the couple began dating. They received attention after Paul joined Spanish giants Atletico Madrid. In 2022, he made the relationship official with an Instagram post. Di Paul joined Racing Club's youth setup in 2002, aged 8. He was called up to the main squad on the 24th of June 2012, while still a junior. During his time here, he appeared in 19 matches during the 2012 to 2013 campaign. He then played a key part in 2013 to 2014, featuring in 35 matches and scoring five goals. In May 2014, Di Paul joined Valencia CF who agreed to a $6.5 million deal for him with racing. He made his La Liga debut on the 23rd of August that year. However, Di Paul just scored only one goal in 15 games during his two seasons here. In July 2016, Di Paul was transferred to Italian Serie A club Udinis, becoming Udinese's club captain in December 2020, replacing Kevin Lasagna. In July 2021, just days after winning the Copa America with Argentina, the 1994-born midfielder moved to his new club Atletico Madrid in a five-year contract. Di Paul made his senior international debut for Argentina in 2018 and later became a regular under manager Lionel Scaloni. He was an integral part in Argentina's victory of 2021 Copa America, which is their 15th Copa America title and their first major international title since 2008. In 2022, he was also part of the squad that won the 2022 FIFA World Cup. As of 2023, his net worth is estimated at $23 million, which mainly comes from his football career. After arriving his new club in Spain, Di Paul found a luxury villa in Madrid, Spain for his stay. This house is said to be worth $1.2 million. This property is located in an exclusive enclave bordering the regional park of the upper basin of Manzanares. The house's design is dominated by large exterior and interior spaces spread across three floors. It has four master bedrooms, each with a large dressing room and in a suite bathroom as well as four guest bedrooms and bathrooms. The villa's exterior is equally impressive, with a tennis court, 
barbecue, salt water pool, various chill out areas, solarium, and gardens surrounding this wonderful luxury home in Madrid. There are two cars in his garage. The first car is Mercedes-Benz E-Class, which was estimated at $60,000. This is a good vehicle. It has a variety of powerful engines, including turbocharged four and six cylinder engines, as well as a twin turbo Voltaid. The ride quality is excellent, and few luxury midsize cars can compete with this Mercedes interior opulence. And the second car he has is NMW3, which was worth around $50,000. This is an excellent luxury compact SUV, in addition to offering plenty of passenger and cargo room. The X3 is fun to drive and boasts engines that run the gamut from plucky to truly powerful. The base engine gets good fuel economy as well. It can reach a top speed of 174 miles per hour. Rather than flaunting his exotic cars and mansions like his teammates, the midfielder prefers to share details about his vacation. In reality, DePaul spends the majority of his free time visiting beaches by himself or with family members. He sees it as a way to recharge his batteries. He occasionally posts various exciting pictures of the beach memories he made. The Argentine regards his body as the ideal tool for documenting the success of his career expedition. Furthermore, he has numerous tattoos on his body that detail his accomplishments and the people who helped him achieve them. His tattoos include his daughters, baby mamas, grandfathers, and mother's names. It also includes the date of his first game with Argentina, a portrait of him as a child, and a beautifully tattooed lion. And that's all for our video today. I hope you find this interesting. If you have any questions or recommendations, let me know in the section below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.